I desperately want to tell the world their story. I want you to hear their struggle, so they will be forever remembered. I admire the hardship they live by every day. This land is Kokochili, the third most uninhabitable region on Earth. It's 4,700 meters above sea level, the last resort of the endangered Tibetan antelopes on Earth. Due to the recent demand of the Tibetan antelope pelts on the market, they became favorite targets of the hunters. They were hunted down mercilessly by machine guns. Their population soon diminished from 1 million to 10,000. The local government organized a special patrol team, mostly made of local Tibetan volunteers, to protect the antelopes from the local poachers. But recently, one of the volunteers was brutally murdered by the local poachers. The press in Beijing wanted me to interview the patrol leader, an ex-Tibetan soldier named Ritai. I finally met him, and we immediately connected. He agreed to take me along with his men on the patrol. Little do I know that would change my life forever. His men and I got along famously. They are glad to welcome a new face on the team. Our journey started here, and it lasted 12 days. The men seemed so happy and enjoying their job. They sang and danced, unaware of the hostilities around them. The environment's very hostile. One can die from dangerous predators, the merciless cold, exhaustion, starvation, and most of all, poachers who hunted them from the shadows like they hunted the antelopes, who were constantly getting into firefights. Some of the men used to have easy light. Some were fathers. Some were teachers. Some were businessmen. Yet they gave up their lives. They were understaffed, underpaid, and neglected by the Chinese government. They would run out of bullets, run out of money, and run out of men, but they still put their lives on the line. They're not mythical heroes. They're not gods. Just hardened, united men who decided the killing should stop.
I sincerely wish that my story would bring them hope, because that's all they have left.